Paint the Town Possible, where we recognize those who are making Manitoba inclusive and accessible. We're talking to Rhonda of Beautiful Plains School Division today. Rhonda, how are you? I'm good, thank you. Wonderful. How are you making things possible at your school division to be accessible and inclusive for all? We've done American Sign Language tra training via Zoom. And even though I'm the one being interviewed today, this work uh, and the success of this project involved the Manitoba Inclusion Support Branch, uh, involved the Ma folks at Manitoba Possible, along with all my fellow student service coordinators in Westman Parkland. We recognized that in our school divisions in rural Manitoba, there was a need to have more training available to our staff. And um, with everyone working together, we were able to offer uh, ASL level one training in the spring. And today is the last day of the ASL level two training. Can you tell us about how you're helping paint the town possible within your business practices? Specifically to Beautiful Plains School Division, that's um, my school division. We really took advantage to the school closure in the spring and we decided to train as many staff as possible through um, the Zoom technology. And this was all in efforts to support a young fellow who moved to Canada and into our school division who had limited communication um, due to his hearing loss. So in the spring uh, in Nipua, we trained um, classroom teacher, resource teacher, three EAs, myself and this young boy's mother um, in level one ASL. And we also had several other school divisions join us at that time. That included Mountain View School Division, Southwest Horizon School Division. So we had a group of 11 or 12 of us that received training. And it was just amazing to have that happen so that we were all able to go back to our school divisions and support lots of kids. What would you say to other organizations or schools looking to be more inclusive and accessible? One of the things that we really decided was that we needed to support this child in every way, which included um, his family, his friends, and um, the adults that work with him at school. And this year, um, the teacher who took the level one training decided to train all of his classroom on uh, the basic level of ASL that she received in the first level of training so that all children would have the opportunity to communicate and i have to tell you that it's just been the most one of the most rewarding things to see um, him in the class communicating not only with the adults in his world but the uh, his classmates as well all of the success that we've had not only was the result of all of us advocating in the beginning to get this to happen for rural manitoba but we were blessed with a very dedicated instructor, Carol Bentley. Greater understanding and greater education leads to greater inclusion. And we've certainly see, have um, seen that happen.